that moment when everything stops, everything but your heart, because there are two ways out, death or survival. But in that moment, everything comes together as if your life were a puzzle scattered in pieces. Everything you've known and have never known. Everything remembered, everything forgotten, all come to reckoning. Suddenly, your past and your future become your present. Who you've loved, who you've lost, who you've found, and who's found you, and who you are. Right about then, your identity is finally clear. You understand why you are who you are in this moment, and how you became that person. Then your mind capacity is enhanced, and you begin to realize why opposites attract. How life can be death. How death can be life. How sight can be blinding. And how blindness can be sight. How free will can be predestined. How the fact was we never knew what was fiction. How the truth is that we all lie. I'm only doing this for my father! How the life we thought we lived good was evil from the start. And your guilt rises along with all the sins in you. Then you think to yourself about what you have, what you need, what needs you, what you deserve, what's been taken from you, and what's been given to you. Your life doesn't flash before your eyes, but everything important does. The times you've hesitated, the times you've risked it all, the times you've planned ahead, now time is slowly beginning to move again. You know that if you survive, you are immediately attacked by forgot of what happened, but remain aware that something did. You know that if you die, you'll find what you've been waiting for your whole life. Finally, you're left with a decision, a dilemma of sorts. So there you will find yourself at an end, that moment.